Hey, this is Tony with Tab Gear. Let's talk about the carbine sling today. This is how I would typically have the carbine sling stored with the excess webbing secured with the built-in retention device. And then when I go to sling, put the rifle on or sling it, I'm simply, simply sticking my hand through and popping it and it comes out of the retention device just that easy. So then I'm going to sling it. If you need to, you can tighten it up with the pull tab and continue to tighten it by pulling the webbing. So now the sling is as tight as it can get on my body. If you need to go hands-on, you need to go down on the ground, the, web, the webbing is going to pull the sling over to the side so it's out of your way should you have to kneel down, stand up. If you've got to draw a pistol, the, the sling is held against the body and out of the way. To take a, a shot, I do not have to loosen anything first. That There is enough bungee in this sling to allow me to get full extension. Also, if I need to go muzzle up in the back, there is enough bungee to allow me to extend the webbing, to extend the sling, the bungee, and throw it over the back. If I need to come back up to the front, there's enough bungee, you just simply grab the sling and stretch it back around to the front. If you need to loosen the sling, pull, loosen the sling. If you make transition drills, you're able to do that by simply changing sides with it. So there's a quick demonstration of the Tab Gear carbine sling.